Earning your degree online doesn't mean you have to go about it alone. At Capella University, we're here to support you when you're ready. From enrollment counselors who get to know you and your goals, to academic coaches who can help you form a plan to stay on track. We care about your success and are dedicated to helping you pursue your goals. Going back to school is a big step, but having support at every step of your academic journey can make a big difference. Imagine your future differently at capella.edu. You're listening to a Mint podcast brought to you by HD Smartcast. Good morning listeners. Welcome to Top of the Morning by Mint, your weekday newscast that brings you five major stories from the world of business. It's Wednesday, July 31st, 2024. My name is Nelson John. Let's get started. Top of the Morning by Mint. The Indian stock market's frontline indices, the Sensex and the Nifty, closed flat on Tuesday, July 30th, reflecting mixed global cues. More than a year after the Hindenburg setback, Gautam Adani led Adani Group's expansion is in full swing. The Ahmedabad-based conglomerate is considering acquiring JP Group's real estate business for up to a billion dollars. Mint's Anirudh Lashkar reports that the planned deal could quadruple Adani's real estate footprint. solidifying its position in the bustling property markets of Noida and Gurugaon this is part of a strategic offer adani is preparing to pitch to the lenders in the massive insolvency saga of jayprakash associates which owes a staggering 50000 crore rupees for jp's real estate and cement businesses the adani group is willing to invest 15000 crore rupees this move could catapult adani into the league of heavyweights like godrej tata and mahindra in the realty sector India is on the verge of potentially opening up its online gaming sector to full foreign direct investment, a move that could significantly benefit the industry. Mint's tech correspondent Shovik Das reports on the government's plan to allow 100% FDI in online gaming, specifically targeting real money games of skill while excluding gambling and betting activities. This initiative aims to simplify the process for Indian startups to attract foreign investments in this high growth sector. Although there is currently no ban on FDI in online gaming, regulatory ambiguities have made it difficult for companies to secure banking and governmental clearances, deterring potential investors. As Ola Electric prepares for its IPO this Friday, with the price band set at 72 to 76 rupees per share, top executives and early investors are poised for significant financial gains. CEO Bhavesh Agrawal's stake is expected to be valued at nearly 10,000 crore rupees or approximately 1.18 billion dollars. Additionally, he plans to sell some of his shares, potentially earning around 240 crore rupees at the lower end of the price band. The total issue size of the IPO is estimated to exceed 6,100 crore rupees, including an offer for sale and new shares. Mint startup reporter Priyam Vadasi notes that prominent investors such as Japan SoftBank Group, US hedge fund Tiger Global Management, and Matrix Partners India are all set to benefit significantly. Bollywood siblings Zoya Akhtar and Farhan Akhtar could see their shares in the company valued at 1.3 and 2.5 crore rupees respectively. Recently there's been a noticeable buzz around premium products in the FMCG sector with more people willing to spend extra for quality items like hair serums, granola and fabric conditioners. Min Sunira Tandon cites a report from market research firm Kantar indicating that premium categories have seen impressive growth about 16% in volume and 24% in value from April 2022 to April 2024. That's quite a leap. What's driving this trend? It seems that categories once considered luxury, like sensitive toothpaste and anti-aging creams, are now attracting more buyers. For example, the number of households purchasing sensitive toothpaste jumped by 47%. And it's not just more households buying these products. People are actually spending more on them. The story of Henry G. Davis, a Wall Street magnate before World War II, offers a timeless lesson on the value of long-term investment and the intricacies of market timing. Despite turbulent periods such as the mid-1930s stock market sell-off, Davis maintained a strong fundamental investment philosophy. His key insights, wealth, 
often comes from holding stocks over the long term or capitalizing on opportunities during market downturns. Interestingly, today's investors face similar challenges, especially with evolving tax policies that can influence investment decisions and capital growth. The recent union budget adjustments, like the increase in long-term capital gains tax, have raised concerns about future tax hikes and their impact on investor returns and behaviors. Yet the core principle remains successful investing is less about reacting to immediate fiscal changes and more about strategic long-term planning. In this long story by Mintz Abhishek Mukherjee, you'll find a practical guide to rejig your portfolio in light of the recent budget. You can read all the featured stories by clicking at the links in the show notes. We'd love to hear your feedback on this podcast. Let us know by writing to us at feedback at the rate You may send us feedback, tips or anything that you feel we should be covering from your vantage point in the world of business and finance. That's all for today. Thank you for listening. We're eagerly looking forward to our next Top of the Morning episode, which will be packed with fresh business news. Until then, have a great day. Top of the Morning by Mint. Earning your degree online doesn't mean you have to go about it alone. At Capella University, we're here to support you when you're ready. From enrollment counselors who get to know you and your goals, to academic coaches who can help you form a plan to stay on track. We care about your success and are dedicated to helping you pursue your goals. Going back to school is a big step, but having support at every step of your academic journey can make a big difference. Imagine your future differently at capella.edu.